I'm going to fight the wither a second time. And this time, I think I'm prepared. Gotta get everything ready. We're going to go back into the strip mine and fight it. First, let me find a good area. Right next to zero. Down here. This might be where I fought it last time. Indeed it is. What do you know? Okay, I'm going to turn up brightness. <clears throat> That's not what I want. Oh boy. That's not what I wanted. I think I didn't bring any torches. Hold on. I'm going to just turn off my resource pack really quick because it changes how the light looks. That way I can see down here. Ah. Here's the old soul sand. I'm going to try to trap it again, but I'm not, I'm not sure that it'll work. Um, hmm. Oh, whatever. I won't try to trap it. I'll just spawn it normally. Oops. Okay, so that didn't happen. The axe does no better. about here. Uh huh? my woundedness. Where? I bet this is worse than the Ender Dragon. Closer. No, it's right there. Oh no! Kill me! Yes! <laughs> And I didn't die before I killed it. I might die now, though. Yeah, I'm probably gonna die. Better get somewhere where I can get my stuff back. Hurry up! Not gonna make it. But I won! I killed the weather! <laughs> I'm a boss now. Hello! I'm NanoMK. Today, I'm playing Minecraft. 
just sitting in my mom farm, listening to the lovely sound of mobs crunching and dying with the bones and death. Like that. Wonderful. Um, also, I made more progress on the super duper ultra hyper mega epic boss levels smelter of destiny. Um, I got the mine carts and stuff. Now I need to build the building. You don't even understand how much I went. I went all across my Minecraft world looking for iron, iron ore, just to make all the hoppers, and it still wasn't quite enough. I ended up finding enough eventually, but that was like about two tons of effort. <clears throat> Yes, I'm measuring my effort in tons, because why not? Anyway, I'm just trying to figure out how I'm going to design it now. And I think I'll do it like this. I want to... I cooked up a bunch of actual smooth stone. And, <laughs> and I'm going to be using it for the uh, floor, at least a little bit. <clears throat> also, I'm congested, and I have my warning voice, so good luck with your ears, because I don't care about them, so far I did so many tests with my bike so, so that it sounds good, so I guess I do care about your ears, but it's more of me caring about my ears, because I want it to sound good. <clears throat> that doesn't sound good, but it doesn't matter. So I'm going to design the uh, floor. Uh, yeah. Oh right, I forgot to tell you, I had to change the size of everything just so I could have enough hoppers for it. So instead of doing bunch of rows of blast furnaces and smokers. I did one row of ten blast furnaces and one row of eight smokers so that I can still prioritize furnaces because they're the main cookie, cookie thingy, you know, they cook stuff. All furnace like. I don't know. But yeah. And I should turn these into slabs. Because I want this to be the slabs. And here. And here. And I'm going to leave these areas open so I can put glass just to make sure that the minecarts are still moving around. And then. about that congestion again. I'm not apologizing except for when I just did. <laughs> oh look, there it is again. Yeah, that's why it doesn't take up space all the way to here. So, I'm probably just going to cover it up with grass and not really use it unless I come up with something else to use it with. Or Stone. Uh, 
Oh, you know what I should do? Because I have to on messing up my hills and everything. I should put cobblestone under this and then put grass on top so that they don't, like, destroy the stuff. <coughs> No, maybe I'll just... No, I can't. I can't do it for all the times I clear my throat. I was gonna say, maybe I'll just cut out the audio whenever I clear my throat. But no! That won't work. That won't do. Because I'd have to do so much more effort. And I want to record and play Minecraft. Not cut out clo clo throat clearing. <coughs> like that. Yes, I know, I got stuck. That's fine. Let's do it. Check all the hoppers. Oh, this guy's this one's stuck again. Give me that. And move. <coughs> I said move. time making <sighs> it went into the <sighs> okay this one um Come on! What? Erg. <laughs> there. Now, go and move around. Go and move around. There we go. My access in here. I have to have access. Okay, so I'm just going to check all of them. Yeah, I guess check them all. See if they have anything that I dropped in them. Aha! Okay, so that's those. Now I need to check the furnaces. Wait, how did the coal get there? Oh, that must have been testing. This is tedious. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and make a fatal mistake and uh, assume that there's no stuff left in the system. <laughs> and, uh, yeah. 
I also need to make a better way to access that chest. Yeah. Um, let me make some more letters. Let me get some more letters. Ladders are always great, aren't they? Except for when you can use bubble columns. Okay. Let's break our legs. And do this. Okay. Now we can access the chest at the bottom. This is the output for all the stuff. So now I need something to cook. Um Yeah, that could be a problem. I guess I'll cook some more cobblestone. Yes, that's gonna work. Problem with that is I need fuel for all the furnaces. I have some leftover bamboo. So the furnaces have two fueling spots. One here, where it says furnace fuel, and another here, where it says furnace fuel. So you put the fuel into the furnace fuel thing, and then it puts it in the furnaces. I need to get more, because that's absolutely not enough. I'll take just charcoal. Anything? No, mobs don't drop any fuel. You know, what would be good fuel is netherrack, but I have to, I think I have to change that in the data pack. Actually, I don't think you can turn, you can make, you can change things into being fuels or not. But either way, um, there's the furnaces input, let's put in the cobblestone. My cart comes over, eventually. Yeah, and pulls out some cobblestone and distributes it among the furnaces. Let's see if they're doing anything. Uh, I can do it here now. This, yes. Any furnaces on? That's not good. There is one furnace on. There is no going into... What? What? What's going on here? Oh, I didn't even clear out this area. For all I know... Uh, there. It's clogged. It's a cobblestone in the fuel hopper. But still, it should be filling it up more. Is that furnace light? No, it's sunlight. Man, why isn't it filling them up? Stupid minecart. Is it stuck? No. There it is. Going around and around. Open it. There's nothing. What? What? I am confused. <laughs> uh, 
that's the furnaces one. There's the furnace fuel one. Here's some of the stone, but it's not distributing it very well. Um, I think I need to place this somewhere where it stops. Or make it a double chest. I mean, that could work. It means I have to stop it from moving. Yep. And break it. Double chest. And then fill it with bamboo. And then place the mine cart back on the track. And then push it. <laughs> and then hopefully it'll pull out more than. Nope, it didn't help. It's not doing much at all. Well, I tried. Also, I wasted tons of iron. Oh wait, it did. It puts stuff in three of the furnaces, but it's not enough to keep them going. <laughs> oh man. It's not, it's not doing anything, it's staying in the same place. Erg. disappointed. I have to figure out how to fix this. It doesn't even work as good as my special smelter. But I got some ender pearls, <laughs> so that's nice. I'm going to waste most of them in order to get back to my house. <laughs> Alright, so I have two extra now. Um, I'll get back once I figure out something to do.